Hello, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Mings, and I welcome you guys back to the advanced campaign. I, like I said, that's a rough opponent. Doesn't this old sea dog deserve some smooth sailing now and then? <laughs> How many stupid naval references can they put into my lines? Drake, listen. About our earlier conversation. Ahoy there, eagle. It's time for you to test these waters. Battle Orange Star yourself and see if my theory holds any water. I think you're right. Yeah, let's uh, just kill some more of their troops to see if our theory holds up. Seems like a good idea. Very humane. I got to get the job done this time. Yep, you do have the command because we need we need you to play you on this map to get rivals. Here we go. Mission 16. Wings of Redemption. No wait. Wings of Wings of Victory. <laughs> I just... Oh, I know why I said that. I watched uh, Down the Rabbit Hole with Wings of Redemption last night. One of my favorite videos on YouTube. Hey, man, listen! Listen! Ah, what a what a sad tale. Eagle, why do you keep harrying us? It's you again, Sami. Well, excuse me for getting in your way. Listen, will you just explain... <laughs> listen, listen! Will you just explain to me why you won't leave us be? It has nothing to do with you. Bring out Andy. I want to settle this now. No, absolutely not. I'm in command now. You can't ask for Andy unless you get by me first. Don't do this, Sami. I won't hold anything back. It's okay. So yeah, in traditional Eagle style, he'll have like a million fighters and bombers. And uh, how I'm going to try to beat this map is by going for an HQ cap, as with always. Uh, so the only units that we need really need to survive is we need this transport copter to survive, and we need a single fighter to survive. So we need to send it over here. Drop an infantry, try to cap. But the problem is Eagle has not one but two stationary bombers. He has one here and one here. So we need to take one of them out. This is why we need one of our fighters to survive. So what I like to do on this mission is I like to capture these two properties. Uh, I just like to have them. And then I send pretty much... Ooh, that's bad actually. I don't want to be wasting fuel like that on this map. Uh, I send my fighters and my bombers over here. I could, I can resupply it later, I suppose, but still. Uh, yeah, I don't want to be wasting fuel like that. You waste fuel when you do that, in case you didn't know. So I'm going to be doing this. I want to keep my transport kind of tucked away safely here. There we go. I'm going to lure in this tank to attack my APC. And I also kind of have to keep my medium tank alive, if possible. That's usually a very smart thing to do, because the, you need to take out an anti-air later on. I don't want to fight Sami, but it looks like I've got no choice. To the skies! Simp. I am Eagle, I don't want to fight Whammon. I only respect the Whammon. I am bad boy, but I also respect the Whammon. There, I shoot at her, because I respect her so much. This is the best way of showing you respect a woman, is to shoot at her APC with your tank. They love that. They love that shit. Alright, so um, now we gotta set up our units. Uh, I'm gonna attack here. I'm probably gonna pull my APC back and refuel my, my fighters because they will actually need the fuel. Because I'm gonna be flying around on the map with them a lot. So, um, this Batacopter, I actually don't mind using it. I, I, he has some fighters. I, I always forget their range. I don't remember if I can be attacked over here. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna send my Batacopter over here, I think. Put my tank here. And... Yeah, I think I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna finish my capping. I'm gonna put my transport here. And yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna resupply because why not? There we go. I don't think his bomber can reach this medium tank at this point, so I think I'm fine. And yeah, it's pretty much just sit and wait for his fighters to swoop in. So he always moves his fighters first, as you can see right here, which is very good for me. He didn't move the maximum range, though, so there's still a fighter out there, so I gotta be careful. It's gonna be a very hurtful lightning strike next turn. This is why I like to cap these two cities. I just like to have them to supply my units on. In case they get injured, I can pull them back to heal. But yeah, Eagle has a lot of units on this map. A lot of units. And yeah, that's good. My missiles get to take a shot at his fighter. That's always good. So he has two fighters on this map. So as long as we have one fighter of our own, we should be fine. So I'm gonna move over here. Take a shot at his fight, or sorry, what, sorry, his bomber. I need to kill both of his bombers, ideally. That'd be nice. Um, so I'll do this. 
However, if I'm gonna do this, I gotta be very careful because, there, as I said, there is an anti-air over there. And I don't want it to shoot down my fighters. And he's gonna get his lightning strike next turn, so that's gonna hurt a lot. There we go, good rocket shot right there. So, at this point, I probably want to use my, um... Yeah, I probably want to use my anti-air to... I'm gonna send my infantry over here to block him. Yeah, I'm gonna send in my tank first and foremost, take out his tank, like so. And yeah, I pretty much just want to shield my fighter for his, from his anti-air. I know it's here somewhere, it's in the forests. It's either, like, here or here. And because of lightning strike, he's gonna have a lot of mobility next turn. That's gonna kind of suck, so... Anyway, down goes the fighter. Sorry, the bomber. And if I do this with my medium tank, then I will take out the tank, and I will also shield my fighter, but I also risk the medium tank getting shot up by the bomber next turn. So that's gonna be a little bit annoying, but I don't really think there's anything I can do about that right now. However, I'm going to sack my battlecopter. I do need to be I do need to be careful with this transport though. Very careful with this transport. So I'm gonna put my APC right here. I'm gonna pull my infantry back to surround this thing. Yeah, my bomber can go here. And yeah, pretty much this uh, this battlecopter is just gonna get sacked. This fighter is gonna find it next turn. So here we go, very good. There's this other fighter. He's gonna shoot on my fighter, but that's okay, as long as I have my other one. I'm all honestly okay with this. Okay. That's very good for me. That means he's blocking his other bomber from reaching that medium tank, so I'm actually really happy about that. There's the anti-air. So hopefully that anti-air goes for my battlecopters and not my bomber, or sorry, my fighter. Where's my fighter? Ooh, it's very exposed, actually. Okay. I don't want to harm Sammy, but what choice do I have? Okay, I'm a little worried right now, because he might shoot on my fighter now. Let's see what he ends up doing. Mm. His firepower will be greatly reduced, though, so maybe I can just combine my fighters together. Oh, okay. Nice. He actually shoots... Ah, oh, that's amazing. He shot at my battlecopter. Lovely. That's perfect. So I still have my fighter. That is pretty much as perfect as it gets. If only his fighter was within range of my uh, missile, that would have been even more perfect. But yeah, I think I'm gonna pop my double time now. Eagle, enough is enough! Alright, so the first thing I gotta do right now is I gotta find this untire. I think it's over here. I guess I can use my fighter to scout that out. Oh, sorry, my, my infantry. There we go. So yeah, I need to kill his anti-air, I need to kill his medium tank as well, so... I guess we'll start with this bomber right here, this is good. Pew pew pew! And yeah, I think I will just be using my fighters to take on out his fighter now. They don't need to be on full health, this is fine. Mm, yeah, this is as good as it gets, I think. As I said, I can always combine them together later to, to make a full H HP fighter, and that's probably what I need to do. There we go. That is pretty much as good as useless right now. So that is as good as it gets for me. I wish my mechs were in range of his entire. That would have been really smooth. But sadly, it is not to be. It's still dead next turn, though. So at this point, I want to start moving my transport towards him, so I'm going to be loading up this, uh, I guess, this mech. I can put my transport here and I can load up my infantry next turn. That's also something that I can do. And I'm honestly okay with that. There we go. Let's get rid of this bomber right here. Beautiful. And yeah, let's, um, hmm. This double time didn't end up being, like, super... Super useful. Yeah, I'm gonna pull my medium tank back to get healed. And yeah, that's... I think I pretty much set myself up to win here. It kind of depends on what Eagle does this turn. I think he has another bomber, doesn't he? Oh, yeah, there's the fighter. The one HP fighter. I, I'm actually very surprised. I almost never keep my bomber alive through his lightning strike, so that this is very new to me. Every time I play this mission, I always... Uh, yeah, there's that, that goddamn second on tire. 
Very scary. But I am uh, double time Sami, and you are not going to kill me that easily. Look at how tough her infantry are when she pops her power. It's insane. Alright, so... Um, now we need to be careful, because as you can see, there's a, even there's another anti-air coming towards us here. I'm not in range with that fighter, am I? No, I'm not. I haven't been very good with my indirects this map, I will say that. Kinda wish I positioned them better. If I got, like, an extra missile shot, I don't think I'm gonna get the S rank as a result, but we'll see. Um, okay, so... Is there a unit here? I have to find out if there's a unit here. Guess I can scout with this. I can do some damage with this too, why not? It's gonna die, but I don't care. There we go. Oh, wait, my infantry is damaged. Oh, that's really bad, actually. I didn't real. Oh, right. Ooh. Okay, I need a healthy... I need a healthy unit to get through here. But that shouldn't be a super big problem, actually. Yeah, as long as I can use that mech, we should be fine. Okay, so I'm gonna move my fighter up here. And then I'm gonna move my second fighter up. Yeah, this is... Probably not going to be an S rank, I think, because I wasted too much time. So I'll move up here, and I'll prepare to load this mech into this transport copter next turn. And I'll move my fighter, my fighter over here. All right, let's see what we can see. Ah, yes, there's the bomber. That is okay. I actually think I'm going to go and do this now. Silly as it may seem, it's better. It's more important for me to take out this anti-air so it can't shoot down my fighter or transports. I will actually gladly sack this bomber in order to do that. There we go. And yeah, I'm, I'm gonna just keep my medium tank on, tank on the city, why not? Yeah, he has two more medium tanks as well. Eagle will eventually overrun you here. You can't really beat him in a fair fight, which is why I'm going for the HQ cap. But yeah, please come at me, bomber. I want to kill you. Uh, yep, yeah, beautiful. Just in range of my entire too. That is gorgeous. All right, so I should be able to move towards him now. Uh, yep, everything is going beautifully. So there we go. That's what I want. I want to get over on this little pond right here because there's no more fighters in this area. There's just a single bomber right here. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do this. There's the fight, or there's the bomber. Oh, no! Oh, that's uh, not so bad, actually, but a little bit annoying. <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, um, okay. Uh, I was actually hoping to join them up. I didn't realize there was a unit there. I probably should have realized. But it's not a big deal. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna just kill this Antire. I think that's his last Antire, actually. I hope that's his last Antire, at least. All right, medium tank, ready for action again. Pulling the APC back. I'm gonna put the missile here, even though I don't think it's gonna do much. Oh, hi there. <laughs> it lured in the bomber, I guess. Man, it never ceases to astound me how dangerous eagle bombers are. All right, so what we wanna do now is we wanna go and take a shot at this bomber right here. And ideally, it would be nice if we could get our double time next turn. I'm gonna see if I can sack some units just to get it. And we're gonna load off Sami's mech right here. Yeah, we are definitely getting double time next turn. I don't even have to work for that. He might actually get a lightning strike, but it's not really gonna matter. I actually think he will get a lightning strike. If I'm getting my double time... Yeah, oh, he's definitely getting his lightning strike, all right. Uh, but that's okay, he won't really have many units left, so I'm not too scared. His bomber will never move unless there's a ground unit in range, and he can't see it because he doesn't have vision on it, so... Hell, I might even do this. Why not? Yeah, let's just use our bomber. He doesn't have any Empire left, I'm fairly certain, so this bomber pretty much has free reign. This is the first time I've ever played Wings of Victory and kept this bomber alive. I'm not used to having it at this point. I'm like... I don't understand why it's here. Like, this should be dead by now. I don't understand how Eagle didn't get it. Alright, so here comes the lightning strike. It's not going to be a very deadly one. But I'll be able to win this on day 9, which I'm 
fairly, yeah, there's the missile. Fairly certain it's not gonna be an S rank, I think it's gonna be an A rank. If I was able to, like, position my missiles a little bit better, I think I could have gotten the S rank here. There he goes. So, uh, yeah, not a very devastating lightning strike, but that's okay. So, but I'm gonna have my double time ready, and you'll see this is actually very necessary, because Eagle has yet another bomber south of his HQ, and we need the defense boost to survive that. It's gonna deal 5 HP of damage to our Samimex. There we go. And then, it's actually the 4 HP... Yeah, the 4 HP bomber is actually enough to kill it. Nice. If I want to, I can I can do some scouting with my other fighter. Maybe I'll maybe I'll find his bomber. Let's see if we can find it. Uh, yeah, there it is, right there. So that's why you need double time, pretty much. I don't actually need to do anything more. I won I won this map now. So, sorry, Eagle. I'm not I'm not gonna destroy any more of your units. So yeah, <laughs> he has a missile situated in the forest right there to shoot down any transports, but. The missile itself isn't really a threat to your H to your HQ cap strategy, but this is why we need double time, because that gives us just the defense we need to only take five damage from his bomber, and that will allow us to cap his HQ. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how you beat Wings of Victory as Sami. Not the best Wings of Victory I've ever played. Again, I'm pretty sure I would have been able to beat this one turn earlier if I just positioned my missile a little bit differently. But, I guess this will be an A rank, which I'm pretty happy about. Start talking, Eagle. I'm listening. Very well. I'll tell you everything. I'll tell you all about it. All about how Andy attacked my homeland, Green Earth. Huh? The look on his face during the assault, I'll never forget. Never! Eagle, stop it. Stop what, Sami? Look at who you're accusing. Andy couldn't pull off anything that complicated. You suspect this kid, who has his hands full just getting dressed? Um, excuse me? Well, it's not really a face that shines with intelligence. <laughs> Hold on a... Exactly. Andy spends the entire day not thinking of things. Alright, that's... If you put it that way, it's hard to imagine Andy pulling it off. You guys are mean. <laughs> but I'm not completely convinced. I still suspect you of something. If I find that you're lying to me, Andy, you'll curse the day you were born. He's not such a bad guy, but boy, is he stubborn. Yeah, that's an A rank, I think. Yep. Woo! Alright. Wings of Redemption successfully beat. By the way, if you play Andy as the... No, wait. No, that's the previous one. Nice. I'm rank 69. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.